Here are this week's sports newsmakers. Rafa Nadal is off to his best start in the season. The world number 5 extended his unbeaten run to 15 after claiming a record tying 4th title in Acapulco. Nadal became the oldest champion in the tournament. He beat Cameron Nori in the final of the ATP 500 event. Jermaine Ancaja's reign has ended. Following a stunning defeat to Argentine Fernando Martinez. In his 10th title defense, Ancajas lost his IBF super flyweight belt by unanimous decision. The upset was his first loss since 2012. Ancajas hopes to get a rematch with the undefeated Martinez. DeMar DeRozan is making a strong case for MVP. DeRozan has been on an offensive tear for the Chicago Bulls. He became just the seventh player in NBA history to have eight consecutive games with at least 35 points. The five-time All-Star also scored 35 or more on at least 50% shooting for a record eight straight games. Behind DeRozan's stellar play, the Bulls are just a game behind the top spot in the East. Andrei Rublev clinched his third trophy in a span of a week. The seventh-ranked Russian continued his winning ways by topping the Dubai Tennis Championship. It was an emotional run for Rublev, who pleaded for peace after his nation's invasion of Ukraine. Rublev wrote, No war, please, following a semifinal win in Dubai. Northport is on a roll. With a three game winning streak after dropping its first five games in the PBA Governor's Cup, the Batang Pierre beat the top two teams in the league during the stretch. They are the only team to beat number one Magnolia so far. <laughs>